Welcome to another Chef Knives to Go Quick Look product review. I'm Steve G, and what we have this time is the Kohetsu VG5 Nakiri 175mm knife. Uh, this has a multi layer construction, it's three layers. Uh, the core steel is VG5 stainless steel. You can read about that a little bit on the product page, but good quality stainless steel um, that takes a nice edge and has, you know, reasonable edge retention to it. It's easy to sharpen. What they do is put a soft stainless cladding on either side of that coarse steel. The cladding line is very faint even in person, so when we do our close-up, I'll try to show it to you, uh, but it might be a little hard to see, but the cladding does cover the, the spine, so it's an all stainless blade, easy to maintain. Uh, the heat treat on that coarse steel is probably around 60 Rockwell. Um, the handle on these is an octagonal uh, gray pack of wood, uh, black pack of wood handle. It's a stabilized wood product. Uh, they do have a, looks like a really good seal job there where the tang goes into the handle. So nicely done. Uh, in terms of weight and dimensions, uh, these can vary just a little bit. This particular one is 147 grams or 5.2 ounces in weight. The edge length, the usable edge length is around 165 millimeters or 6.5 inches, and the overall length is about 315 millimeters, or 12.4 inches. It's a fairly thin blade, although it's got some stiffness to it. It's about 1.7 millimeters thick at the back, and then I get about 1.6-ish halfway down, and then it pretty much holds that until you hit the end of the top here. The height is about 47 and a half, so decently tall. Uh, you've got a little bit of a quick curve here coming off the choil into the neck for your finger. Uh, there's a little bit of a discrepancy, but it's not straight off the handle, but there's a little spot you can put your finger in there. If you got bigger fingers, it might not fit quite as well, but there's a spot there for that. Balance point is going to be a little further back. These handles are a little bit uh, longer and slightly bigger uh, circumference, so a little bit heavier. So the balance point is going to be a little further back. It's pretty much like right in there's your balance point on this one. So it's not going to be hand uh, blade heavy. Uh, let's look at the choil or the beauty shot here. Guess we'll go with that. Uh, fit and finish is nicely done. Um, it's got screened in or embossed kind of screen kanji on the right side of the blade. And if you look carefully, you can see the cladding line here. It's Boy, it's, it's hard to kind of show that. Uh, there we go. It's hard to show that, but there's a cladding line there. And then there's your core steel, there's your edge. Uh, here's the left side of the blade with a few fingerprints on there. But again, if you can kind of catch it, there's your cladding right there. It's, it's Again, it's hard to pick up in person. Vertical finishing marks on it. Uh, nice fit and finish. They've taken a little bit off the edges on the top on the spine, and a little bit off the corners or the edges on the choil into the neck here. Uh, this was 7 out of 10 on my scale as far as out-of-the-box sharpness goes. A very sharp out-of-the-box. Uh, I think that's about it. Let's take a look at the cutting board profile. Nikiti knives can be anywhere from extremely flat to a little bit curvy, so let's see what this one looks like on the cutting board. So you'll see this one is pretty flat. So when you, it's got a, a kind of a curved tip there. So you can rock this as high as you want. But when you start going down, it will hit a shelf. And you can see there's a little bit of back belly back there. It's just a little bit of relief, but there's a big old flat spot right there. So this will chop really well. Uh, it's not dead flat, which is good because that's hard to use. But it's pretty flat. And you, you can rock that tip as high as you want because it's a rounded tip. So pretty good, just kind of general Nikiti style uh, edge profile. So this is just a very, very good line of knives. Uh, it's, it's a high value line, nice fit and finish, good quality steel. Uh, this is the Kohetsu VG5 Nikiti 175mm knife from Chef Knives to Go.